Hey there guys, and welcome back to Deadly Creatures. It's time for Chapter 7, The Forgotten. Again, starring the spider. So, yeah. I've been away all day. Going on a little country exploration. I mean, uh, by that I mean... A game store in the town pretty far away had a bunch of games that I wanted to get. So I hopped on the bus, then the train, and then I got the games. And that took the majority of my day. But let's not get into further detail on that. We shall continue our spidery adventures and immediately are facing off one of them red-headed lizards again. I'ma call them ginger lizards. Because they probably have no soul. Come on, shoot him in the face with some of the good stuff. That's what she said. Oh, this is going to be... That spider's web shot is really good for a lot of that's what she said jokes. Alrighty, let's spider along this wall, see what we find apart from some grubs. Man. Oh, the crap. Spiny lizard. Whatever the hell it is. And... F crap. Why do I always fail the feeding part? I just don't like the waggle controls. They don't really work for me. But yeah, Lizard is dead. And I'm pretty sure this is like the same map that we just went through with the scorpion in the previous part. Except now it's just the spider going through it. And crap, do not jump on the cacti. Cactus is cact. Yeah, I think it's cacti. I reckon. Yay, finally I'm pulling off the feeding correctly. Wait, I fed on it and it's still alive. How is that possible? Oh well, it's dead now. Let's see. Spider over here. And I'm still really pretty sure that real life spiders can't, you know, jump. Uh, help arrow... Point me the way. Okay, up here. This game, I've said it before and I will say it again, gets so confusing at times that you'll be absolutely ecstatic there's a freaking help arrow. Okay, go over there now. Uh, it's pointing that way. Alright then. Are we upside down now? I'm pretty sure we are. I have a feeling we are. A hunch. This game needs a compass. Although I guess that's what the help arrow kind of serves. Oh well. Ah, crap, more lizards. Do I have to fight those? I'm pretty sure I will. It's inevitable, really. Just like Cyborg Chimp. Or Ninja chimp or whatever from time splitters all right let us fight the lizards give him a face full of web I said give him a face full of web there we go damn it game you do need to do what my narrations command you oh and a little spider buzzsaw action holy crap lizard used takedown it's very effective spider bounced all over the bloody place and Venom Strike. And feed on him. And fail at it. But he still dies nonetheless. Due to the Venom Strike. Okay, we need to get in that hole. Where I just shot my white stuff in. Oh, that's another pretty damn good that when she said jokes. Uh, you shot white stuff in a hole. It's in your window and that's funny. Alright. Hey, it's the weird... Treasure Hunter guys again. Hey, I hit something. I got a handle. I got it. Good God, there's a dead lizard down there. Well, where else should it be? There you go, baby. Come to daddy. Woohoo! Here, let me see that.
How much you think's in here, anyway? Enough. <laughs> Sorry, old buddy. It's just not enough gold to go around. Betrayal. I mean, damn, hitting him over the head with a shovel? That's gotta hurt. I mean, I remember, like when I was a kid, playing on the beach, I remember getting hit in the head with a shovel once from some other kid who was also digging in the same hole I was. And that hurt like a bitch. Maybe that's why I'm so weird, I just got hit over the head with a shovel. And that spider ate my grasshopper, so now he and his family must die. Ah, crap, it's more rats. I hate rats. I drowned a rat once. Or was that a mouse? Nah, that wasn't a rat, it was a mouse. A little mouse glue, and then just drown him. They actually drown pretty fast, mice. It must be because they have such tiny lungs. And yeah, that awesome crazy banzai jump attack kills the rat in one hit. And then the spiders return. And it needs to load in the middle of combat, which is kind of weird, you do not really expect that. Come on, just die you guys. No one likes you, I'm the top spider around here. What, you wanna argue with that? I don't think so. Okay, I think that's the last of them. So then we shall spider in here. Ah, crap, black widows. Although that one looks more whitish. Could just be the lighting, there's a red one. A red widow, a red black widow, a rack widow. Yeah, it's a widow with a rack. Nice. Ah, crap. I'm outnumbered, and I can't fight them when I'm on the wall like this. Okay, they're dead. Uh, help arrow, point me the way. You are my guide in this incredibly confusing game. I swear, without the help arrow, I would be so lost. Alrighty. It does look like we're getting out of the Cactus Canyon and into, like, a waste yard or something. Like a scrap pile. And how did, can we feed on bloody spiders? I mean, there's hardly anything to feed on. Okay, kill those in one hit. That's pretty weak. Why do I keep failing at the feeding? It's like you have to be real freaking specific about it. And yeah, he can block all he want, but he can't take a face full of web. That'll cause him to drop his guard, and then he dies. Just like that guy. Ah, oh, oh crap, mites. Get off me. Uh, I see a shiny little web in that... Was that, like a lamp or something? does look like a lamp. Jump! Yeah, that's actually like one of the few places you actually have to jump over gaps. You don't really have to do that hardly ever in this game. Like, it's no Mario-esque platformer. Thank goodness. Not that I don't like Mario, but not every game should be. Like, well, I've, let's just say I've been recording a whole lot of Super Mario Sunshine lately. And that game is hard as hell. I mean, now nah, you'll see it when I do the inevitable LP of it. Which could be sooner than you imagine. Although it's still not among the next batch, which is No More Heroes 2, Times Players Future Perfect, and Ben 10 Aliens Force Vilgax Attacks. Oh hey, there's the guy again. And he's dragging the body. Although he's not dead, I mean, I take it the guy who got hit over the head with the shovel was the one talking in the intro in chapter one. And the other guy must be the one that is in a coma now, for some reason, which will probably be explained later. And yeah, it's an albino rat. They like cause the white plague instead of the black plague. Who knows? Spider down in here. Let's see. Okay, there's a pizza box. 
with rats in it, that's real tasty. You really want to, like, find that in your own house. But I bet that's something you Americans should have more experience with, because Americans tend to be like... Eh, let's not go down that line of thought. I will probably never hear the end of it if I do. Uh, grasshopper. Die! Did I get him? Yeah, I got him, alright. Alright, now let's crawl into this dollhouse here. Yes, uh, it's not a real house. I mean, if that's a real house, then this is a freaking huge-ass spider. Uh, grub. Okay, I can't get grub. But I can like that. Ah, crap, Black Widows. Where to? Go up. Okay, spiders can walk stairs, apparently. Even if they're dollhouse stairs. So let's save up, and yeah, that lamp. It's probably where we need to go next. And then... Uh, where to? This is a little confu... Down there? What, is that like a Darth Vader helmet over there? That really looked like a Darth Vader helmet for some reason. Crap. Great. What, can't get over this either? Can't even jump over it either? Oh, come on, game, don't be a bitch. What the hell? Oh, it's not a Darth Vader helmet, it's a trash bag. How the hell did I get those two mixed up? Grasshopper. Holy crap, where did that scorpion come from? Ah, great. Two scorpions. Oh well. We are the god among spiders, so that should not really be a big deal for us. I mean, come on, we're the bloody Chuck Norris of tarantulas. Where'd the other one go? There he is. Come on, stand still for a second. Banzai! Did we get him? No, he's still alive. It's weird. You're not supposed to live my Banzai move. Uh, this looks like a broken terrarium. You know, a big glass box you keep spiders and lizards and stuff in. Don't really know what it's called in, Eng in English, but in my language it's called a terrarium. For some weird reason. Okay, Black Widow, you would die. You would die, I say. Did I just knock him out of the dollhouse? That's awesome. Okay, spider up the stairs. And then what? Oh, hey, grub. I like me some grub. Alright then. Over there it is. And uh, then where do we need to... It's pointing down there, but there's, like, nothing there. The F? Oh, no bloody way, I fell off again. How the hell does that even happen? Isn't the spider, like, supposed to have bloody suction cups? Or sticky hairs with which it sticks to walls or whatever? Now what? Uh, what the hell is this? Am I glitching up? What, I glitch up and then I die for no particular reason? Oh, that's just real freaking perfect now, is it? Oh, oh, I swear, if we're gonna have to do the entire bloody chapter again, then I will piss off. I will be pissed off. Please. Please, game designers, don't be assholes. Okay, not that bad, I'm back up here. Alright, it's pointing towards there. And I do not really see anything over there. Oh! Is that it? Screw this. Ah, oh, crap, spiky lizard. But why do I keep saying, oh crap, those guys are easy as hell. I mean, they hardly ever do anything to me. Because they tend to have them whacked before they have a chance to even attack me or something. Alright, that's one down and two down. Told you they were easy. Loading again. Now, where are we going? It's dark. 
Looks like sewer pipes or something. Are really gonna crawl out of someone's toilet later on? That would be kind of gruesome. Everyone would not like it if a big fat hairy spider crawled out of my toilet. What's that? Oh, it's those bloody wolf spiders again. Man, there are so many of them. Alright, bring it on, bitches. I like the weakest enemy in the game, I can totally take them. Apart from, like, the pill bugs and stuff, those are... Although those are not really enemies, they're just, like, food. That's playing hard to get. Come on, you. Go and die. I don't know why, but the lighting and the little red spots on the floor makes me feel like I'm in a volcano. And I'm pretty sure spiders don't like heat that much. Or I think they do like heat somewhat, but not like volcanic heat. So that's like too hot for them. I mean, yeah, I don't think bugs like the cold. I mean, I don't really think there's like bugs in the Arctic and stuff. But they can't handle too much heat either, I think. Like there are... There's no bugs in the volcanoes of Hawaii, for for example. Although, there's probably like some wise ass who's gonna post in the comments, Oh no, there's bugs on Hawaii and on the South Pole and stuff. You're completely wrong, you're an idiot. Kill yourself. Yes, I've had comments before telling you to kill myself, yeah. Those people are just messed up in the head. And I tell them that and then I block them so they shall never bother me again. Like these mites. They should never bother me again. And sweet, we're on a giant wrecked car right now. Uh, where do we spider into? Ah, crap, beetle. Oh, crap, it's the wasps. The tarantula hawks. Even though I still don't see how they have anything to do with hawks. I mean, name them bloody tarantula wasps if they hunt bloody tarantulas. And yeah, my health is really looking so good right now. But who just left a perfectly good pickup truck here? Always you Americans wasting stuff. I mean, that thing's perfectly usable. If you're like little hillbilly hick cowboy living in Texas or whatever. Yeah, and I've never been to Texas. I've never been to the majority of the USA anyway. I've only ever been to Florida. And also some city, something with a D. Like the plane we took to the, to the States, like stopped there and then we had to get on another one or something and get to Florida. I think it was like Philadelphia or something. Or Pittsburgh or whatever. Something with a P and a D, I reckon. It's probably Philadelphia, and then we like flew on to Orlando, Florida. Which is the best place in the world. Who knows, maybe I'll do a little USA tour someday, and you can all like go out and meet me if I can like post on Twitter where the hell I am. And whatnot. I do know that I'm gonna go to like England. I'll be going to England pretty often in the future. Part of my new uh, the new study I'm going to follow because law school really wasn't my thing after all. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure like in the first year I need to go to like Bath in England and go to like the University of Oxford. So who knows? Maybe some of you will like run into me there. Although I, I'm all, I obviously won't be like carrying out around a huge channel like, Oh yeah, I'm General Secure, aspiring YouTube celebrity, yada yada. I'm not freaking Fred. And this looks like a whole bunch of spider web shooting. Let's see. Yeah, we're we'll probably gonna have to like jump from web to web here. Grabbing grubs along the way. Yeah, we can't even get off of this, like, TV set, I think it is. It's like a Smash TV set with a big spider web on it. Another grub. 
Uh -huh. And then we jump over there. Man, this place is a mess. Someone ought to clean this up. You bloody Americans, are you polluting the bloody environment? I mean, take better care of your deserts. Although they're probably going to be there forever anyway, because a desert can't really l possibly look any worse. I mean, it's just sand with a whole bunch of cactuses and stuff. And vermin. <laughs> yeah, back when the American deserts were filled with buffaloes and the likes. Before you guys hunted them all to extinction. Yeah. Why do people always, like, hunt the coolest animals to extinction? I mean, I've, like, read something somewhere about some kind of gigantic manatee creature that was like 15 meters long and was apparently still around until like the 1800s or something when people hunted it until it was extinct I mean a 15 meter manatee creature do you rem can you imagine what kind of crowds that would draw at like SeaWorld that would totally be awesome but no Anyways, these praying mantises, praying manti, I keep messing up my animal pearls, do I? Alright, come on, shoot him in the face, because that apparently causes his arms to stick together, and then we can kill him. 250 points. Hmm, I think that's actually like the most points we've ever gotten so far for an enemy. And now we're in a mattress, with springs. Yay, trampoline! Alright, there's the exit. I don't think that was a mattress, I think that was like the car seat. Because I think we're still inside the car. The uh, overturned pickup truck that's wrecked. Oh, now what? Eh, rats. Not again. I hate rats. Why the hell do dinosaurs die out and these things are still around? Bloody rats, I hate them. Die. Although, can a tarantula like really kill a rat in real life? That, uh, that sounds kind of a little optimistic. I mean, this tarantula can because he's obviously the Chuck Norris of tarantulas, but I don't really think a standard tarantula should like kill or can even kill a whole bunch of rats and I really need to watch myself because I'm almost dead and I don't want another bloody game over ah crap there's another one hopefully this kills it then this one ah crap another spiders they're not giving me a break here are they where's it? I need grubs or grasshoppers Okay, there's a grub. Sweet. Perfect. Wait, I got full health just from eating that green grasshopper? Score. That's totally winning. Alright, you there, spider guy. Stay still so I can jump you and kill you. Alright. Moving on. Yeah, we're, I think we're still in the car. Save our progress, just in case the game glitches up and causes us to randomly die again. I swear that was not fun. Uh-huh, go here. Hey, there's the steering wheel. Uh, we need to go down, apparently, to, like, the gas pedals or something. Uh, yeah, we're upside down now. Oh, crap, wrong way. Uh, how do I... Okay, now we're the right way up. So I guess we're, like, gonna crawl into the engine now, or no, we're going outside. Uh, there's... Oh, spider web. Let's see where that takes us. Okay, now we need to go to that web. And I really like the spider levels, they're like, oh, you need to stop and search around for webs to shoot at. It's like, do I, 
Did it really have to be like this? Okay, we're apparently in the headlights now. Yeah, yeah, that's real nice. Grab the grub and crawl up on top. Yeah, where are we gonna go now? How the hell did that lizard even get up on here? Pretty sure those kinds of lizards don't have, like, the suction cup feet like geckos and stuff, so they shouldn't be able to get up here. And they also shouldn't be able to hover in midair when they're dying. Okay, that's more like it. And I see a little spider web over there. That's like a really long jump, and still we do it in like two seconds. Um. Now we can go over here. This is confusing. Okay. Uh. Arrow, you're not really helping me out here. Oh, there we need to go. Just jump in between the cactus needles. Spider is fearless. Uh, yeah. Oh, we need to move along the bumper. Yeah, that's... Without a doubt, that's the car bumper. Alrighty then. And... Spider web over there, we can jump there. And then we're almost at the end of this chapter. Hooray! Adventure goal complete. Sweet. Okay, there's a cutscene right before the end. Oh crap, it's the guy, no! Hey little darling. 